You need to ensure that all the radiators in the system have been bled to remove any bubbles that could potentially prevent the unit from heating unevenly. Turn off the heating, then allow the radiators to cool down. Go around all the radiators in the house and remove the cap from the lock shields. Then turn the valve anti-clockwise to open it. Ensure that you open the thermostatic radiator valves, TRVs, fully. You may need to use the lock shield valve adjuster or adjustable spanner to do this. Turn the heating back on and make a note of which radiators heat up. This will give you an idea of the order that the water reaches each unit. You need to turn the heating back down and wait for the whole system to cool down again. Turn the heating back on again and head to the radiator that heated up the quickest. Close the lock shield valve by turning it clockwise, then open it by a quarter of a turn. Wait for the radiator to heat back up, then take the temperature of the pipe that leads to one of the valves. Take the temperature of the other valve that the pipe leads to. Carefully turn the lock shield valve until there's a difference of 12 degrees Celsius from the last temperature. To balance the whole system, you need to carry this out on all radiators around the house. Contact us on 01942 265042 www.radiator-sales.co.uk